today in your sketchbook, we're going to do a fantasy insect. Um, but it has to have the main uh, features of a true insect. Insects have uh, three main body parts, the head, the thorax, sounds like a Seuss name, doesn't it? And the abdomen. The thorax, um, actually anything that else is that's connected is connected to the thorax. An insect has uh, three pairs of legs. So pairs means two. So it has a total of six legs. They have five joints in them, each, each one of them, although some of the joints are longer on other different legs. And if it has wings, they are attached to the thorax as well. An insect can have um, two pairs of wings. It can have a hard outer shell and it can have an inside um, wing. And then they often have antenna and they have uh, compound eyes. Sometimes they also have a simple eye but I think um, you need to have the three body parts, the head, the thorax, and the abdomen. You'll need to have three pairs of legs attached to the thorax. And then it's your choice if you have wings and if you have the hard outer shell or not. Um, and remember that the legs are not like people legs, they, are, they have five uh, segments to them. So you create a fantasy insect. Um, is a butterfly an insect? Yes. Um, is a beetle an insect? Yes. A fly, a bee, a grasshopper, praying mantis. Um, is a centipede an insect? No. Is a pill bug a, or a roly poly an insect? No. And uh, what are spiders? Spiders are not insects, they're arachnids. So, fantasy insect, three body parts, head, thorax, abdomen, three pairs of legs with five segments. Your option for wings or not, but they have to be attached in the thorax. And I look forward to seeing what you come up with.